What up? What up? What up? What up, chat? King Kilo. Hey. What up? What's good? Hey, happy Sunday, everybody. I got to fix my do-rag, man. <laughs> do-rag can't be messed up on, on, on the live, man. No, right. that's, that's like one of them swimming caps, man. Hey, man. Listen, <laughs> a do-rag is a do-rag. That's a do-rag, bro. Anyway. Hey, what's going on, man? Let's see who we got up in here. We got True Swag TV. Uh, what's going on, bro? I appreciate you pulling up. True Swag TV too. Hey, what's up? Uh, change to my other channel. Hey, what's going on, bro? I thought I came and in then clutch. My boy Chuck is in the building. Hey, I appreciate you pulling up, Chuck. So, what? What's the count now, bro? I don't know, bro. I I lost count. I ain't even gonna lie. I I don't even know where we at. Wifey was supposed to be keeping the count too. She 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 slipped, so we slacking on the counts. But tonight we're gonna be going through some collabs, and um, I was like, you know what? I I review a lot of the, of King Kilo shoes. He review a lot of mines, and I'm like, I'm like, hold on, he got some of my collabs, and I got some of his. <laughs> so I might as well have him pull up and and we review uh, and we show the ones between the two of us. So, um, lol, let's say a hundred. Hey, I don't know if it's I don't know if it's a hundred, bro. I don't think it's that much. Not yet. May, maybe I have hit a hundred. What on the shoes you showed so far? Yeah, maybe I have hit a hundred. Yeah, I think it's your fault. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I did hit a hundred though. But um, <laughs> make sure you guys uh follow King Kilo TV. Let me make sure. I, I I'm pretty sure I, I still got his link down there. But if not, I'm about to put it in there right now. Make it real easy for you guys. Um, bro, I just here. I just hit eighteen hundred this morning. Hey, congratulations, man! Thank you, thank you, brother. Congratulations. Give me so far. Let me see here. Mm. So I seen your video about the Kobe's, man. How, how you like the Kobe's in person? In hey, hand, they, like they are a little hey, grab too them. Hold on, hey, hey, everybody, let's let's look at these Kobe's real quick. Hold up, I got them right here. I just did the review earlier. Hey, True Swag TV said, what up, bro? Got the Kobe 2-4 right there. It's like 3M on the back, like right here. It's like 3M, like yeah. the little bomber thing. And then on the swoosh, it's 3M. It got like, bro, they were saying like, because I didn't watch anybody's videos at first, and then I did. But they saying like the tongue is like the OG tongue that they had on the Pro Tros like way back in like 2012, 2013. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, oh, that's kind of tough. But I like this tongue better though, cause it like fit. Like when you put them on and like tie them, like they yeah. like it fit real good. Like it fits good. The drop sole is crazy though, bro. Yeah, that's what I was telling everybody in the sizing video, man. I'm like, dude, that that thing. Hey, you take the drop sole out, put a thin. That's like going a whole size up, bro. Yeah, facts, facts. So the drop sole, look, look how thick this thing is. Yeah, dude. They it's, they comfortable, bro. Nah, it's comfy though. I will say that, like the heel cushion on it, it's like I give it like an eight out of ten. It could be comfier though. It could be comfier, but I saw like um, I saw like a wear test on these, and they said the traction on these is like crazy. It's better than the fours and the sixes. So I'm like, hey, bro, I might have to get some eights to hoop in for real. Yeah, dude. But no, they, no, they said the traction crazy. crazy. Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait to uh. I can't wait to get my pair in, man. <laughs> yeah, bro. I was just on, like, I, when I was on my live, I was just looking at it, and, like, the prices are kind of, like, like around $300 for the Venice beaches. The yep. Phillies are, like, $350, and then the camos are just, like, astronomical. Like, they're just crazy. Yeah, like, the camos you know, is just, like, when it comes to the camos, you can forget it, because that sneaker is, like, five five fifty six hundred, bro. Yeah, bro. It's crazy. Like, it, I was surprised that it was more than the uh, reverse Grinches, to be honest with you. Yeah. But I, I think it's going to drop, but we'll see. Hey, what's going on, Smooth? Um, South King, King Kilo TV, Chuck, and everyone. What up, what up? What's up, brother? Hey, as you guys come in, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button um, for your boys, man. Hey, what's going on, Steph Keeks? What's going on, my guy? Nothing much. Chilling, broski. Chilling. Chilling. Hey, what's up, Titanic Peak Jack? What's going on, man? Hey, as you guys come in, hit that like button. I greatly appreciate it. Make sure you guys, if you're not following King Kilo TV, make sure you guys follow him. Um, 
down in the description section uh tap into his channel uh just hit 1800 he trying to he hey. trying to get as many as he can just like i'm trying to get as many as i can so make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe and, and all that good stuff man um so <laughs> king kilo salute man yes sir uh smooth what it do hey so uh titanic feet bro we're gonna be going through the collabs we got in our collections tonight um normally this is a solo thing but as i said a while ago we, we we review a lot of the same sneakers and stuff like that so uh we was gonna um we just gonna do this thing together tonight so um y'all if y'all haven't been on any of the lives on sunday basically what happens is is that um i go through my collabs or the sneakers that i'm showing for the night and I just tell you guys what year they came out, all that good stuff. If I got a story behind it, like how I copped it or why I kept it in the collection or why I feel like I want to sell it, I just share it. So um, just story time. That's it, bro. We uh we'll be in tune on the chat. Um, hey man, y'all, y'all see y'all see this, bro. This thing right here, <laughs> bro. I popped the I popped the pimple and that mug is it, it got it got it got beast mode on me, bro. <laughs> he don't got good skin, y'all. <laughs> he don't got oh, good skin. Man. I've been tuning in, bro. I appreciate it, man. Hey, we got 10 people in the building. I mean, we should definitely have 10 likes. So make sure y'all hit that like button. Share the stream if you don't mind. But we're gonna go ahead and get this thing popping. So um I'll I'll start it off. Why I put that out? Cause man, I cause man, as I look at myself in this camera, <laughs> Thanks, I can't bro. I, was, see it. I was thinking the same thing. I was like, "Hey, bro, I can't, really help, that. I can't help but see it, see it, cause I saw, <laughs> so I'm like, you know, the live stream about to be. Hey, we gonna see, man. And hey, the funny thing, smooth me, me and King Kilo, we was talking, and he was like, "I ain't got that many collabs," and I'm like, "Hold on, bro." What you mean you ain't got that many collabs? Then he called me and he like, bro, I low key got more collabs than what I thought. I'm like, bro, I know you do. Come on, man. Like, yeah, what I was you mean tweaking. Collabs. It's because, bro, I have some shoes in storage right now that I don't. I don't have everything with me, so I know I got a couple shoes that I don't even have with me that are like collabs. I'm like, damn, bro, I ain't even got nothing. And I came in here, I'm like, oh, I actually got a decent amount. Yeah, man. I'm, so I'm like, dude, what the heck, bro? Um. <laughs> anyway so all right so we're gonna go ahead and start so i'm gonna start with the <laughs> first collab now i'm gonna start with the collab that um on my end i was like man i wanted it real bad and then when i when i got the sneaker it reminded me of a sneaker from back in the day and i'll tell you guys which one it remind me of but i got them all over here so let me grab it so the first one is going to be when y'all see the box you gonna know what it is hold on hold up <laughs> And I've been trying to get rid of these things, y'all. And don't nobody want them. All right, so. <laughs> All right, so y'all see the, y'all see the, the, the logo. You man. know what it is? Yeah, that 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 box went through some some man. Dude, man, some hey, tears. listen. So, all right, so the first one is going to be. And like I said, this is just me. I, I when I got them in hand, I didn't like them. So it's gonna be the clock kiss of death Air Max ones. Oh my now goodness. for me, like I said, hold on, let me see, make sure my camera focused. All right, for me, this sneaker, I don't know, it was this, it was this toe box, bro. <laughs> this toe box don't do it. Hey, hey, who who in the chat remember the Air Force ones that was like <laughs> the plastic Air Force ones, the all see through clear Air Force ones, like 06. <laughs> 2006. Dude, I put these things on for our own feet, and I didn't even post a video because man, my feet was sweating. That thing fogged over like a like a Cadillac windshield, bro. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, what the heck, bro? That's so, so crazy. So yeah, man. I mean, the, the the shoe ain't bad. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not a bad sneaker. It's just that I just if they, I think if they would have closed this off, yeah. You know, but you know when this thing, I think it first dropped in 2009. Or 2006, one of the two. And the only reason why I feel like it did those numbers, bro, was because they made it so limited. 
if they would have gave it like they didn't make this release that limited and then all of a sudden nobody wants it you know what i'm saying yeah, but yeah so so my first collab starting out the gate we're gonna go with this 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 one right here man i actually got a story on those man remember when i was like reselling i paid yeah. for those early and i paid <laughs> like i paid like 300 and like some dollars bro i would Dang. never i will never see like the man i am today we just doing retail, man. We not doing like hey for real. We not doing no uh pay for stuff early, bro. That's crazy. I'm I'm mad I even did that. Yeah, so if any if anybody's interested in those, those are a size eleven. I think hold on. Yeah, that's size eleven because like I knew I knew they was they didn't have that much cushioning and stuff in them because they're of the see through toe box. So I went a half a size down and they fit perfect. But if anybody's interested in a size eleven in the clock. Air Max ones, dead stock. I will ship. I I will sell them and ship them to you for sixty dollars flat. Just somebody, somebody take. Hey, somebody take these things off. Hey, that boy Chuck said I'm gonna pass. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, listen. So if anybody interested, all right, bro. Your first one, bro. All right, let's see. All right, you start off with something light, so I'm gonna start with something light. Uh. I got the crafts. You feel me? Tom Sachs. But I don't even got the good colorway. I used to have a good colorway. I got this Dookie Brown colorway now. <laughs> I got this one, bro. Bro, these like the these like the wear everyday officials, bro. You can put these on with anything. This is like the most universal shoe. But I ain't gonna lie, man. I had the uh original white pair. And I ended up getting rid of those. I sold them. I think I like did like a trade block on them. I ended up getting something real good for it. And I ended up selling the other pair of shoes. But those, man, like I remember when they first came out and the hype was so crazy. Like the, the white pair was going for like $600. Bro. I was like, nah. Yeah. But when these came yeah. out, these came out, they was like a little bit under resale. So you can get them for like 80 bucks. So I ended up getting a pair, picking up a pair for like $80 and securing this because it was like a really general shoe and i wore these to work i literally wore these for 30 days i wore these for a month straight and they don't even really? look like they've been worn bro yes i wore them for a, a, a month to work bro but i work inside so you feel me they ain't really getting dirty but i'm walking all day yeah so yeah that's the that's the first one man we starting off light all right all right so Let's see what these comments saying. Now nah, you, you now nah, you stuck with those, Jay. Come on, man. <laughs> uh, you know what my size, but I might. Hey, listen, let me know, man. Six dollars ship. Hey, you can walk on the back end of them and turn them into house shoes for all I care. I just don't. I, I just don't need them here no more, man. Um, craft. Hey, what's up, Nitro? Hey, as you guys come in, make sure you guys hit that like button. Craft are comfortable, good shoes. That brown pair use using the gym. <laughs> nah, it's what they solid. They solid. All right, so number number two for me. Let me see. All right, next one um is going to be a another one that uh this one here I actually wanted and King Kilo, you helped me get this one. I wanted it bad and they sold out as soon as they uh was on the sneakers app and stuff like that and then they started popping up other places. I guess people didn't want them anymore, but. Uh, uh, this one is going to be so. This is it's another Nike, as you guys can see right here. Um, this is a Hirachi, I love Hirachis, but this one is going to be the limited edition, which it ain't that limited because people really didn't care for them. Um, what was the name of these, bro? Do you remember? Are they the Stussies? Stussies. Yeah, Stussies. Stussies, Stussy, whatever. Yeah, the Hirachis. <laughs> I forgot. Yeah. I forgot. I forgot I helped you get those. Yeah, so this is this is going to be my next one. That's actually so, a solid colorway, though. Yeah, so do, they came out with another colorway. I don't know why my camera... Okay, there we go. They came out with another colorway in these, but this is the one that I really <clears> wanted. That translucent Nike on the back, like... I don't know. It's just like this one is, this one's dope. The red Hirachi on the, on the tongue. So yeah, this one was pretty dope. I wear these quite a bit. I got a size twelve in these, and they still fit tight. Normally Hirachis don't fit that tight, but 
yeah, this one was a, a easy. Well, it wasn't an easy cop. I was able to get it, but then like two weeks later, they became easy cops because people really didn't mess with them. So <laughs> yeah, man, this is gonna be the second one for me. All right, bro. All right, you you starting off with like light shoes, so I gotta. I feel like I gotta go light too, bro. <laughs> I'm going light. All right, y'all. So I don't just wear Jordans in my in my everyday sneakers. I do wear like you feel me different shoes. So these some Saucony Fresh. These the Fresh Rag collabs on the Saucony's. Uh, and this is what they look like. I wore these quite a bit for sure. Oh, them clean. Yeah. So it's like the uh manatee. It's like a Florida, it's like a Florida store. Like I was just supporting for real. But they got cool insoles too. You see on the little insoles, they're kind of dirty though. But look, you feel me? The insole is kind of cold. It's like basically like stop killing the manatees like in Florida, I guess. <laughs> so, but I mean, I guess I guess that's what they're doing. So I don't know anybody that's killing manatees. You know anybody that's killing manatees? I don't know. Now, I don't know nothing, bro. But it comes with like a bunch of different shoelaces. As you can see, like the shoe is like gray, like a little off-white. I don't even know if that's off-white. But it got like a little translucent bottom. But this is the second collab for me. So it's my Saucony's, man. You feel me? If you guys don't have any uh, anything but Jordan in your collection, I can't trust you. <laughs> you, you <laughs> yeah, you heard the man. For yeah. me, can't uh, they fresh? Uh, speaking of Arachis, I need them to release the basketball shoe. Ver hey, they did. They, they released the uh, Lakers colorway. I want to say last year the the black and uh, purple and yellow ones they they released those, um the ones Kobe wore, they re they they haven't released the white ones in a minute though. Hey, those old four Harachis is cold. I remember when mm -hmm. these things came out. For me, I can't wear them Harachis back then and still can't get size thirteen point five. Yeah, that's that's a unicorn sign. My gym buddy wear those uh Sacconis or Sacconi or whatever a lot in the gym. Nike Air Zoom. Spirit on cage two. Tell me y'all have them. I don't, bro. I don't have them either. I don't have them. Don't have them. He said he, he can't he trust you. Trust <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm like future. I'm like future smooth. We don't trust you. <laughs> All right. So next, now some of these shoes you guys have seen because I did go through my Jordan four and stuff like that. But next, uh, let me go a little bit. Let me let me go with this one. So this is one that, um. So this is one that I kind of like, I want it so bad. Um, but then when I got it, I'm, I'm in the, I'm in the process of, I'm sell, I'm gonna actually sell it now. So this one is an 11 and a half, um, dead stock, but, uh, what last year in the, in the year before that I got real heavy and it's, a lot of other people did too with the Jordan one lows. And like it was like every Jordan One low that came out, I was like, I got the highs, got to get the lows. So I was just copping Jordan One lows, copping Jordan One lows. So this one right here was a collab with Soulfly, and it was called an Everglades. And packaging was pretty dope, you know what I'm saying? As you guys can see right here, got the little cheetah print and stuff like that on the bottom. But um, I don't know, it's just something about them when I got them in hand that I'm just like, uh. I really don't need them, so I will be getting rid of these. I actually soon. like that shoe, bro. So, I mean, like I said, the material ain't bad on it. It's not. It's not a bad sneaker. I don't know if it's. I don't know if it's this booty on it, man. That booty don't look right, man. That's <laughs> that's a bad. Hey, that's a bad BBL. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, bro. I like I like that shoe. Yeah, dude. Like, like, look at like you got the the back end and stuff like that. The hey, the the insoles are pretty. The insoles are pretty dope. On them, like the details is is there. Um, <laughs> you got a couple pair of laces with them. Like you got these little ever get uh, these little cheetah whatever print looking laces, red stuff like that. That you got that suede new buck, so it ain't bad. Gun bottom, 
I don't know, but it's just something. I, you know how you get a shoe and you just can't see yourself wearing them. Like yeah. this is that like sneaker. Like I got this sneaker and I'm like, it's dope. Don't get me wrong, but I just can't <clears throat> see myself rocking them. So, yeah, this is gonna be number number what three? Number three, three for me is gonna be the uh, Soulfly Jordan One Low Everglades. All right. Oh, let me let me check. Let me check these comments. Hold up. Hey, what's good, babe? What's what's good, Berto? What's going What's going on, what's my good, guy? Bro? Hey, if you come in, hit that like button for your boy. Make sure you follow King Kilo TV. Link down in my description section. Uh, we just going over the collabs we got in our collection tonight. Um, going to say can't trust you because if only wear Adidas slides and Yeezy slides. So say did. Uh, say did it before Crocs. <laughs> um, bad BBL. I can't see you wearing those. Yeah, man. I my slave ankles would look terrible in these, bro. Slave ankles, boy. Get I'm a, me, hey, true set. Hey, true swag. Text me, bro. <laughs> text me. You know the deal. Hey, I already got one package coming to you. So I know a lot of people <laughs> didn't like those ones, lows because of the animal print. And maybe that's, bro. Maybe that's what it is. Bro, those are nice, bro. Those aren't bad. And they different. You gotta throw the red laces in them though. The red or the uh the cream laces, yeah. All right, bro. You you got it. I'm up. All right, bro. I know you got like a union over there, but <laughs> I got the union dunks, the passport. This is the Laker colorway. You feel me? Ugh. So I got these. So I'd be going on like uh like occasional eBay binge, like for whatever reason. And I ended up buying these for like a hundred and nineteen dollars. So I cut the like I cut the little little canvas thing off of them. I like nicked them right there. But I paid like a hundred dollars for these. Well, I got the union dunks right here. I remember when these came out going crazy because Union dropped like a, a three three pack colorway. They have the argon, the pistachios, and then like the Laker colorway. But yeah, man, I, I might cut the rest of this shoe, but I don't know yet because you feel me. I'll be damaging stuff too much. So I got these. They're pretty clean. I wear these a lot though, like every so often because purple, you know what I'm saying? Can't really rock purple too much. But yeah, Union Dunks, y'all. Yeah, that's got, dope. Them for, got them for a steal. All right, so. Union Ducks, let me see here. Let's read some of these comments. Not going to lie, I'm pretty sure everybody went for those. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everybody went for those Jordan ones, too. Uh, <coughs> Watch BBL. I'm mean, not going to lie. <laughs> um, for, for me, stop messing with Union and Trophy Room a while ago. Why is that, bro? Those cutaway shoes are unique. I like the idea. Yeah. You, yeah. Did you get the other ones in? The SBs? Yeah. Uh, they come in tomorrow. Oh, okay, okay. Um, all right, so let me see. Let's throw let's throw a little monkey in the wrench. A wrench and monkey, <laughs> monkey with the wrench, whatever it is. Hold on, let's do that. Uh all right, let's 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 go back. Let's go back some time. You feel me? Let's go, let's go back a little bit. Yeah, if y'all if y'all remember, so you know, we got a little supreme box. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean. Um, so these here, if, if y'all been rocking with the channel for a while, y'all know that the, the, um, nineties basketball sneakers are like my thing, like the Pippins, the, the, uh, Barclays, Ken Griffey's, even the baseball sneakers, all those sneakers are my sneakers. So when I seen this one, I had to get it. I actually won it off of the Supreme site. This is my first cop ever on a Supreme site. And man, in my opinion, this is probably a shoe that never will leave my collection. But um, we have the Supreme. <laughs> you that little thing. Boy, boy, I'm getting excited. I remember, boy, I, I almost had a heart attack when I cop. So I got to do it like this. We got the Supreme. Air more up tempos. Hey, y'all see that, bro? Instead of the air on it, they say Supreme. They all go everything. Hey, man, bro. Look, man. So those this are like thing, those are like the uh, cactus plants. So you got the you got the inside. It says 
the sup and then the R on the back, and it goes all the way around and spells Supreme. And you still got you still got your your Air Max Air Bubbles in it, so it's it's still the Supreme. I mean, still the up tempo, but man, but then when you put the two shoes together, it just spell out Supreme, bro. Like these these shoes are dope. This is during that time frame. What year was this? This was during that time frame when everything was gold. 2016, they dropped the all gold sixes. Uh, Drake Champagne Pack, they dropped those eights. Like all the stuff was dropping in gold, everything. But I man, as that camera folk, that shoe is beautiful. And this, hey, everything around the Supreme is 3M. Like everything. So if you take a picture, our light hits it, everything around the letters glow. So yeah, man. I man, it's the this thing so fresh, bro. <laughs> hey, and people people probably don't like it, but hey, it is what it is, boy. This shoe is fresh to me. Uh those cut I need to cop the SBs. Let me see the new ones. Those two companies play too much money giving refunds when their products sell out. Yeah, they do that that, that a lot. Yeah. I've never bought any supreme supreme clothes or wear my supreme clothes um more fire you know yep uh hey what's up uh esteban hey man you sound you sound like you got a lot of money man <laughs> esteban roberto hey what up my guy <laughs> hey make sure you hit that like button as you come in um all right so that was mine so now let's see what let's see what you bring man let's see what you got let me see man I'm just gonna bring. I'm gonna bring these these SBs because I just did. You feel me? White box SBs. I got the. I don't even know how to say her name. Reza Leo SBs. You feel me? Gum bottom. You got her signature right there. And then on the front, you got like the little emoji, like beads right here. Her name's on the tongue. You got a little emoji in the back. I think it's gonna be like her signature, like the little emoji emoticon face. But these SBs, man, like these are pretty dope. Cool insole. I'll show y'all the insole. You got like that zoom unit on the insole on the back of it. That's what this look like. You got a little zoom unit, boom. But these SBs hard though. Yeah, these I like them like a couple weeks ago. So, yeah, I'm clean. That's 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 my next shoe. I'm waiting for you to bring out the heat, bro. <laughs> man, hold on, bro. Let bro, me. I know you got the heat, bro. He hey, playing. give me time, man. Give me time. <laughs> uh, let's see. Hey, let me see here. Let's look at these comments. One of the most comfortable shoes ever made. I feel like. Uh, which one's the up tempos? I'm sorry, I'm delayed on these because, man. That year, Trinidad James song was still popping in the playlist. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> For real. I remember when you got those looking like a statue. <laughs> Dang, bro. Come on, man. Come hey, see you right now. Hey, and, I, and I'm bow leg in pigeon toe, man. So the Supreme, you can see it when I walk towards you. <laughs> you can still see the Supreme, bro. Along with the Reebok questions. Yeah, man. I'm Reebok questions. I got some of those. They need to uh, reissue the Air Force Max Fab Fives. Hey, I'm in one of the, about the Kobe. Yeah, hey, I know, dude. So, <laughs> so, bro, listen. He, this, this guy here, right before Kobe passed, a few months, I saw. So, you remember the night Kobe passed the Kobe Elevens? You could, you could ID them. So, I created a pair, and right before. I heard there was retro and everything, so I sold my pair to him for a steal. I think it was for retail, bro. I think that night I did, I purchased that sneaker. I think it was like 200 <laughs> I think I sold it to him for 200 <clears throat> Hey, he still got him, though. You feel what I'm saying? So, hey, I, at least I respect that. But, man, I was like, dude, he, he, I'm like, come on, man. I need that shoe back. <laughs> <laughs> That's me to SB like watching her skate video part more. Um so dope, King. I love them. I don't want to wear mine. I might need to double up on those so I can wear. Uh, she is a pro skirt at 16. Yep. Yeah, fire. 125. See, dude, I sold them to him for 225. Dude, that's that that Kobe. Come on, man. 
Hey, he said 125 first. I was like, hold on, I wasn't that dumb. Yeah. <laughs> Why well, about to say 125, bro? What? <laughs> hey, you was about to say, now you keep giving this. All right, next. All right, bro. So look, now, now. Um, are we entering uncharted territory? Is that what we're doing? Well, see, I still got some, I got some hun huns. So I, I, but I, okay, I, I'll, 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 I'll do something nice. I'm gonna go with another Supreme. I'm gonna go with another Supreme. Ah, uh, here we go. All right, so this one I wasn't able to hit on Supreme website, but uh, somebody hit me up on Facebook, and they wanted a pair of. I had the um, Yeezy 350 um, blue tints, and they wanted them. They see my review back when I used to post my reviews and stuff on Facebook, and they were like, hey, are you selling those? Um, I'm like, nah, not really, because at the time I kind of wanted them. And he was like, well, I, I got I got this sneaker here if um, if you want to. He sent me pictures. He's like, if you want to change it. And I was like. Yeah, let's do that, bro. <laughs> I was like, let's do that. All right, so we got the Supreme. Oh, I took the insoles out of these things. Hold on. Because I, I replaced them. All right, so we got the Supreme Edge One Five in the camel colorway, man. I was like, easily. Like, yeah, you could have you could have the, the blue tints. Like, this is a no-brainer, man. I wish they would have put Nike Air on the back of these, though. I feel like that would have been dope. But come on, focus. There we go. The camel hard, though. Yeah, like yeah. So I do. I've wore the heck out of these, man. Like, sheesh, man. These things have been rocked. But you can see the supreme behind the netting. So yeah, man. This was a. Uh, this was a dope. This was a dope colorway. I like the black ones, but I I, I got the um I had the black um fours anyway. I mean fives anyway. Military black fives or whatever. Um, but. I got rid of those. So then I didn't like the white ones. So I was like, whatever. This is the good colorway. So anyway, um, yeah, that's mine, man. So camo jumps. Camo. All right. Uh, camo jumps. Let's see, man. Let's see. I'm going to do these because like, like, you feel me? Bro, I'm versatile, y'all. You feel me? I don't just wear Jordans, though. You feel me? So I got the new balances. I can't even say that name. Amy Leon Dor. <laughs> I can't even say the name. But I got the 650s. I had the lows in these, but I ended up getting rid of them. But I wore the mess out the lows. And I wore these like, I ain't wear these yet, actually. But I got these. I had the blue ones and the silver ones. Sold them, but I kept these because green really my favorite color. So I got these. I'm wearing these at some point. But yeah, another collab shoe for y'all. Yeah, them dope, them dope. Even though I like New Balances, I like the I like the vintage look on those. You feel what I'm yeah. saying? Like, I like the vintage look on those. Um, love the fives. I wanted the camo fives. Yeah, so those dope. All right, so next, um, I'm gonna go with a sneaker that I feel like people. It ain't bad, but people say it's bad, and I don't understand why. But people get this, this sneaker no love. Um, uh, it's actually under retail. It's actually under retail if you want it. And I, in my opinion, I would grab it. And I wish I would have waited and just grabbed it when it was under bro, retail. Facts, bro. I already know she about that. I got yeah, the same. So, so this one is gonna be the what is it? Beth Bethy's Beauty Supply Air Jordan One. Um, man, like everything about the sneaker is dope. And I, people just hate the, they hate the little stitching, the Frankenstein stick stitching around it. Like, but in my opinion, this is not an ugly sneaker. Like, and the quality is really, really good on it, man. Like the quality is really good. Um, I, I haven't, I haven't rocked them yet, but you wore yours, right? No, I haven't worn mine yet. So yeah, this one is uh not a bad sneaker. Just look at the quality on them, man. Like, it's not a bad sneaker at all. But nobody likes that little move, that little woven stitching or whatever that is. Like nobody likes that. But I don't know. Yellow yellow laces really go hard in these though. Yeah, the yellow laces tough. But yeah, man. 
buy that thing right now. Retail was two twenty five. You can get that thing for like one forty. <laughs> Since you already showed that, I just showed mine real quick because you know what I'm saying. This man he already showed his pair, but yeah, super good shoe under retail. If you guys don't have it, buy it. But yeah, let me go with this shoe for my next shoe. Y'all already know what shoe this is. Jordan three. I'm on my ears. It comes in this sleeve with the A all over it. AM. Gloss it box. And boom, here's the shoe. I got the cream laces in mine. They come with the white laces. They ain't here somewhere. They in there somewhere. But uh Nike Air on the back. Good materials. I definitely wear these, as y'all can see. These definitely get some love shown to them. I love about this shoe. The thing I love the most is that quilted like sock liner. Cause it's super comfortable. So I can wear these all day. So yeah, them, them clean though, man. I'm on my ears. He got the A on the other shoe. Boom. And they coming out with the black pair this year, too. They coming out with the uh the black pair to threes this year. All right, let me see. All right, so since you um since you gonna go I'm mama near, I guess I'll go ahead and let me see. Let me hold on, let me make sure I got go miss the com some comments. I think I messed up a glove as well as Frankenstein wants scars back. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Everybody say the whole Frankenstein vibes when it comes to those. Got my pair and they've been worn a lot. Yeah, dude, they dope, man. I'm going to start wearing mine. Still thinking about picking those up again. Now They're is like the best time. They like 140, yeah. bro. Yeah, like. So my, my threes recently in small cash out. Never wore it. Instead, wore my other shoes. Those two go hard. So um, since you went there, I'm going to go there, too. Uh, oh. Hey. So another I'm I'm Um, uh, their packaging is always on point, bro. Like they give us th their packages reminds me of the old uh Jordan Eleven packaging. You know what I'm saying? So, but this one here, y'all see right here, we have the. Air Jordan Wings logo. So y'all already know what this is, man. Um, the Air Jordan one, these things fresh, bro. I'm waiting for a, a, the right occasion to actually wear these, but like these are dope. You know what I'm saying? I, I was kind of weary about these because of the like the cracked hard material on them. But as I'm watching reviews and stuff like that, people saying the more you wear them, it kind of softens up a little bit, makes it a little bit more smoother. But yeah, these are um, these ain't bad, man. No, I like those. I had a pair. I had like two pairs of those. Yeah, these ain't bad. So uh, I think I ended up, I ended up finally getting these for retail. I got these from retail, my boy. Um, I traded. What Jordan was it? I forgot what Jordan came out around the same time as this one. Was it the Georgetowns? No. No. Anyway, I, I I ended up trading a Jordan for it right out, and I didn't have to pay nothing for him. So it was a it was an easy decision for me. Um, let's move to the three. Am I threes? All right. I if I if wear them, if you have a big collection, might not wear them. So would pass. Um. Now them on my, my cop list there. All my ones are tough. All my threes, ones, white twelves, and fours in that order. Threes, ones. Yeah. I I I go one three. Um <laughs> but that's like I didn't I didn't, I don't like that three. I don't know what it is about it. That's crazy. I had two in hand and then and you know had the option to keep one. So I sold both of them ASAP. I'm like, bye bye. Bye bye. All right, what's next? All right, I don't even know if these are a collab for real, bro. But I'm just gonna show them. I just got them. Is this a collab? I got the City of Love, the SBs. Uh, I, I I don't know if it's more if it's a collab or if it's I don't know if it's name. a collab either, bro. I don't think it's a collab. But I got these. I just want to show y'all just because I just got them. I got them for like ninety bucks. So you feel me? 
Uh, I got these SBs, the City of Love, the coconut, like milk ones. These hard. I got both pairs. So, you feel me? It got a good story behind it. And the insoles are crazy. Cool details on the insole. So, I just want to show them. But All right. that's my next shoe. Yeah, them them clean though. You like you like them better than the uh the other ones, the cranberries. They like they more wearable in my opinion than the yeah. uh than the burgundy ones. All right, so we know why. Yeah, you know why? Cause Jordan one is my thing. Um, no, it's not collab. It's a it's a gr colorway. Yeah, I I mean, kind of figured that. But all right. Uh, 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 let me go with all right so i got a story for this one y'all hey y'all about to y'all about to flip i don't even know if i ever told you this one to kill so all right this this jordan one hey y'all listen to this man we got 13 people in the building make sure you guys hit that like button if you ain't subscribed subscribe but uh this Jordan one. I was I was on uh trade block and I, I had I had this shoe on my wish list on trade block, right? And I kept looking, I kept looking, and the guy that I was talking back and forth was like, Hey, I do I do the wheel raffles on IG. You should just come over there. I got it on the wheel, you might win it. I'm like, All right, cool. So I go to this IG. I put the five dollars in, I win, and I had the option for the sneaker or three hundred and fifty dollars. And I was like, man, I don't know. No, it was four hundred dollars. I was like, oh no. So I took the four hundred dollars. So I, I, but then I had the option to put like five dollars and get back in there, bro. I got the four hundred dollars and then ended up getting the shoe too. <laughs> so we have here. Yeah, boy. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Hold on. The LA to Chicago Jordan One SB. Hold on. Let me move it. let me get the one without the laces, bro. Hey, you ain't wearing yet? Nah, bro. <laughs> LA to Chicago, man. So this sneaker, y'all see the SB on the tongue. Yeah, man, I, I was like, bro, what are the chances, man? So I ended up hitting on this one. So I was glad I was able to get it. Let's see if it focuses. This my camera tripping tonight. Hold on. All right, let me see. All right, there we go. So, yeah, um, for those that don't know, this this sneaker, like, peels. Like, over time, the purple, like, goes away and it turns red. So it's, that's the whole concept of the L.A. to Chicago on them. But um, Kobe Jordan, y'all know I had to have them, bro. I had to have them. To me, this is one of the best Jordan ones. Um, and one day I'm gonna wear it. I got a Mitchell and S Kobe eight ball jersey that I'm, I'm gonna wear with them. But uh, maybe I'll wear it for my 40. You know what? I'm put, I'm gonna wear it for my 40, man. You know what I'm saying? Your boy turning 40, man. <laughs> Shut up, boy. Hey, you're, <laughs> hey, do you remember that that, that interview with uh Cat William and Don Cheeto when Don Cheeto was like he was 50 and, and <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Uh-uh. <laughs> I gotta send it to you, bro. <laughs> I gotta send it to you. Um so yeah, that's my that's my next one. Hold on, let me see. Dang, that's crazy. Yeah, man, for real. Um bro had a rabbit split in his back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you, bro. Hope I as well. Yeah. All right, man. What's what you got next? All right, bro. I got a Travis. Travis Scott. I got the sixes. Travis Scott sixes. I put the yellow laces in mine because they just hit way harder. Yeah. Nike Air on the back. You feel me? And the bottoms do glow. I wear these a little bit, but the the bottoms do glow if you put like a, a UV light to them. So that's my next shoe. Got all the shoelaces and everything. You got the little pouch on it right here. Boom. 
a little stash. But Travis Sixes, y'all. Cactus Jack. Dope. Okay. Um, all right, next. Um, next, I'm gonna go with. I don't know why I put my Carmine Sixes over here. Like they, like they are collab. <laughs> Sheesh. Um, all right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go off white because I know you got off whites over there, so we can start showing some off white. <laughs> all right, so again, I'm not a, a Jordan Five person by any means, but um, I was able to to Keeks for Fresh was able to secure this one for me. On, on the sneakers out when they drop retail retail every every hey check this out y'all every off white that i've ever owned i've always got from the sneakers out like i put, never pay resale i always got from the sneaker app even my travis scott's too now i think about it so um yeah man like i'm not gonna i'm not gonna pay 12 1300 i'm not gonna do that for off whites now kobe's or something like that i will um but for not not for um off whites for whatever reason but anyway <laughs> y'all see the box right here um and then this one is going to be and i like the i like the black ones better charcoal gray whatever you want to call them but hey like i said these work so um uh muslins that, that's what they was called so we got the off white fives uh, come on, focus. This one is in the cell colorway. I think this is the cell one. There we go. So, super clean sneaker. I wear the crap out of these, bro. Like, <laughs> like I wear these a lot. You know what? I keep saying on like fives, and all my fives are like dogs. You wear them. Yeah, I wear them. So maybe I do like fives. But yeah, this is a super clean sneaker. You just Nike came to that realization. <laughs> Yeah, I just came to it, man. Zip tie, y'all know. I'm pretty sure somebody will come back and watch this, this live and say all our shoes fake. You know how they do it. Yeah, they, so, say, all, they say all my shoes fake, bro. It's yeah, crazy. everything everything I own fake. So, but uh, but yet they keep watching me. I guess they like fakes. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, man, off white off white fives on them things, boy. All right, what you got? All right, hold on. Let me go grab a pair of my off whites. They over here in the corner. <sighs> so I'm coming back. Off-white dunks. Get them clean. The Michigans. Feel me? I wear these a lot. These crease to the max. Y'all can see that. These crease to the max. But I ended up so when I first started reselling, bro, I ain't gonna lie, I was like a little hype beast. So I remember when I seen these, I was like, damn, bro, I want the pack. So I ended up getting these for like 380. Got these for 380. At, at the time where like sneaker hype was like through the roof, like I got these for a good deal, I think. Um, I probably would pay way less for that now because I'd be lowballing, but I got these for a pretty good deal. And then I ended up trying to, you know, secure some more, which I'll show y'all later. You feel me? But this is my off-white sneaker. Like one of my like little grails that I got. I ain't getting rid of these. So Michigan Dunks, off-whites, RIP Virgil. You feel me? Yeah, for real. These things right here. All right, them dope, them dope. Okay, so um, next for me. Uh, let me go with uh, uh, let me switch over and go with a union. <laughs> All right, so um, uh, end up hitting these for, for retail. Well, a little bit above retail just because. Um, if y'all mess with in clothing, y'all know that they're overseas, wherever they are. And, um, they're, they're 
um, currency is a little bit different than ours. So something that's like 200 ended up being like 255, 260. You know, I'm, I'm, hey, I'm starting to realize that they bump up their currency based on hype too. It ain't the change in the, like they change it. Like if it's a hype sneaker, they put more than 50, 60 bucks. It sometimes be like a hundred bucks more. I'm like, come on, bro. Like I, I the math ain't mathing, but anyway. they trying to get they trying to make their money too, man. Yeah. So you we got the union right here. And and honestly, this one is one this colorway is probably this this is the second best colorway in, in the union force, in my opinion. Um, I've heard a lot of people say they don't like this colorway, but I don't know. To me, it's 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 one of the most wearable ones anyway. Guava Ice is number one, and then this one was number two for me. So uh we have the Union for Union for off New Orleans. Uh, the reason why I like these a lot is because they look denim, like it's like almost a denim look. They don't look like they are um, just blue suede. But um, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna cut the tongue though. I feel like this actually makes the it makes it unique, and I feel like if you cut it, the uniqueness is gone. So I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, man, these are the put the yellow laces in them because I felt like it just hit harder. So. So uh, the union, union foes for me, man. Bro, I, I had those shoes for like two weeks and then sold them. Oh, I'm, salty. I'm salty. I did that. Yeah, I'm surprised because you, you and Forrest, man, that show. Yeah, I'm salty. I did that. I had a, it was a good deal though. So like, you feel me? I ended up, I ended up getting some, some really good after that. But all right, bro, hold on. Let me just bring all these shoes over. Here. Oh, this, I'll do this one right here. I forgot I had this one over here. All right, I got another off white for y'all. <laughs> The rubber dunks, you feel me? RP Virgil. Are those comfortable? These are mad comfortable. I ain't gonna lie to you. Mad comfortable. It don't come with the off-white a little tag, but these are these are authentic though. You feel me? I know somebody gonna say something. But it ain't come with the tag for real. So I had to get a different one. But yeah, bro. I had two pairs of these at one point. Bro, I used to, bro, I ain't going to lie. I used to be a Trey Block fiend. But I got these right here. Shoot, these are mad comfortable. I really want to complete, like, the pack. But every time I try to go and get, like, another pair, people be, like, the pairs be through the roof. Like, the gold ones, people be trying to sell it for, like, 500 The blue ones, they're trying to, like, 600 I'm like, bro, nah, I can't do it. But you feel me? That's my next shoe. I wear these a lot, too. Yeah, I know you do. I wear these, like, so much. But that's my next shoe. I got like two more off whites for y'all boys. You feel me? All right. So I ain't got two more off whites. So um, <laughs> let's see here. So, bro, I'm trying to tell you. And also with mine too, you can't really find like a size 13, bro. It's like hard to find size 13 in the rubber dunks, like for a good deal. Like people just like they just crazy. Astronomical prices. All right. So I'll go with this one. Um so y'all see right here. We have the sneaker that pretty much changed the whole Jordan 4 style silhouette comfortability for the rest of its existence, in my opinion. Um, Thank you. I, I, feel, I feel like this is going to be the, after this sneaker, this is going to be the, the Jordan 4 that standard. Standard, yeah. Like like nothing else. If, if, if Like, you know how the shattered backboards on Jordan 1s, they're like, oh, quality. Colorway, everything about that silky smooth, milky, whatever. <laughs> this is what this is, man. This is what this is. All right. So we have the Air Jordan 4 SB. We're going to let this thing focus on this beauty. Don't worry about it. It's coming. There we go. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Boy, boy. Them things. 
that Nike that Nike SB the SB just make it look even better on the back end of the thing, boy. I don't know what it is about this sneaker, but I missed out a chance to get those things, bro. I'm so mad. Yeah, dude, and you know what? I blame myself because I was like, I said, man, I, I was like, they 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 gonna drop down. Don't don't get them. They gonna, dude, these things are still climbing. Man. These things are still climbing, and you know. Just man, because people actually love me, I'm glad I got these in my collection, boy. Listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> you said because people love you, <laughs> man. For real, for real. All right, what you got next, bro? Uh, this is my favorite shoe. This is hands down my most worn off white for sure. The pine green off white dunks. This is my go-to. I ended up getting these on eBay for a steal, bro. I paid like $380 for these. And they were like BNDS, OG all, everything. So pine green dunks. Feel me? The bottoms. I don't even know the bottoms kind of dirty. They kind of dirty a little bit. Yeah, them, them, them dope, bro. I like those. Yeah, but this is my favorite, like, out of all the dunks to wear, this is my go-to. Yeah, I like them. Um, did you know, hold on, let me see. One of my favorites, yeah, them SBs clean, bro. Did you, I did uh, not King know the price. Of seven. Yeah, dude, the SBs are up there. They wasn't for a while. And then they went up, man. Yeah, they skyrocketed. They went up. Uh, let me see. All right. Uh, all right. Next for me. Winding down. I think I got only a few more. Um, all right so i don't i don't have many um travis scott's in my collection but i do want to um i do want to start adding more so the but the thing is is i'm not gonna they're dropping some other ones so we're gonna see what, we, what, what happens for retail you know that's why i was the first option um but um the mochas if the the regular mochas, the lows are like my that's like my sneaker that of all time that I want. Um, the high mochas is like number two, but if I had to choose between a high and a low, and, and this is coming from somebody that like highs, I would actually go with the lows. Is I just feel like they should have made that high in that low colorway. Kill the game if they did that, man, boy, like that'd be crazy. But anyway, as you guys see here, Nike box. Oh, hold on. Let me show you. Y'all see that sticker, right? Y'all see that? Is that clear? I just want to make sure. I want to nah, make sure. It's, it's blurry, bro. They, they might still be fake. <laughs> um, so we have the Travis Scott in the reverse mocha colorway. Um, these hit also on the sneakers out, but this is when they did the, they did like a restock of them. And this, that's when I hit on these. Not the first time. This is the second one. So, um, I'm shocked I even did that to be honest with you because I'll never hit on anything, but it was on my iPhone, it wasn't on an Android. I'd never hit on Android anything. Oh, I hit I hit that Kobe's on the Android this time, though. Yeah, sure. <laughs> but but yeah, these are super clean. Um, I feel like when it comes to the colorways, the mochas, then the reverse mochas, no, the mochas. Then the um fragment, then the reverse mochas, and then everything else after that, in my opinion. But yeah, man, Travis Scott's for you. Bye. Travis Scott. All right. I'm gonna do these before I do my last off-white. The Tiana Taylor ones. This is not mm -hmm. actually not my pair. This is a uh, Kicknology's pair. But the one thing I'll say about this shoe. Thank you. Did you wear these? Uh, I did on feet. That's it. So these are brand new. I'm mm -hmm. about to say. But 
hey, this shoe, I want this shoe so bad. The material on this, nuts. You got the little rose right here, Tiana Taylor. And then I think, do we got writing? Yeah, we got writing on the side right here. But the leather, y'all, like, if you guys haven't had this shoe, like, in hand, the leather is crazy. Like, crazy good leather material on this. And then this is the other pair. You got these roses with the thorn all throughout the shoe right here. And then on this one, it says a rose. So this is a hard shoe. This is not my pair, but this is a hard shoe, bro. I've been wanting these for a minute. Yeah, I like those, man. Um, all right, so let me see my... Yeah, the box the box is tough. The box yeah. is tough. Like a lot of details. I don't know about rocking them with that, that big old gold thing on the top of them, but I mean now <laughs> nah, you gotta take like, you gotta take that off. You can't wear that. Um so hold on, let me see here. All right. Next for me. Uh bu, 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 bu. winding down, man. Winding down. Um uh let's go with all right. So we got a SB box right here. As you guys can see, uh, this one was um, probably what one of my one of the shoes that I I wanted just because of the uniqueness of it and in the purpose and what it stood for the meaning and all that stuff. So um, this one right here is the um, the SB Dunk Low Civilis. Um, if you guys don't know. I mean, to the naked eye, it just looks like a black sneaker or kind of like a black sneaker. But um, got the three sets of laces in them. If they don't have the lace bags dangling, <laughs> then they pay. <laughs> if they got if they got the laces rope, roped around them, they not real. But, um, <laughs> but, but anyway, <laughs> so looks like to the naked eye, this is what they look. But these are hypothermic or whatever so what that means is, is that if i were to put my hand on them or rub them a little bit with the sunlight and stuff like that as you guys can see the whole shoe changes so depending on if i'm out in the sunlight if it gets hot enough <laughs> so as you guys can see right here that's a tough shoe. Man, I don't know why my camera don't want to focus, but there we go. So yeah, there we go. So yeah, man. So the whole shoe looks like that. Super clean, in my opinion. Then like, I ain't put these outside either, man. Like, what am I doing, bro? I don't, I don't wear nothing, bro. I don't wear nothing. All the hype stuff I don't wear. So what's the point of having it? You feel what I'm saying? I might as well just Walk what it. you like, not what's <laughs> high. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, bro. I hate you. Show me your next one. <laughs> Only, I hey, I only got one more, man. So hey, nah, this this is my last one. Okay, good. Me too. <laughs> this is my last one, bro. I pretty much I pretty much ended the live with all off whites. <laughs> For real. I ain't gonna lie. So off white UNLV colorway or Ohio State colorway, whatever you want to call them. Boom. This is probably my second most worn off white. And I think I got waxed for these though. I ain't gonna lie. For my other two, I paid pretty good. I ain't gonna tell y'all what I paid for these, bro. I ain't. What you pay for those? I, I paid too much. That's what I paid. I only pay. I paid five hundred for them, which is like that's still a lot. It's not really a lot because at the time I was reselling, so like the money was like coming in and out like real quick. But yeah. you know what I'm saying? It ain't, it ain't that bad. But yeah, All man. Right. Last shoe. This is my last shoe, true. All right. So 
So I, 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 I'll end it with an off-white too, man. Let me see. I know what off-white this going to be. What? What? <laughs> off-white, I ain't going to be able to get until I'm rich. Hey, but look, though. Look what I did to the box, fam. Oh. Oh, they came from uh, Timu. <laughs> <laughs> Man, look what I did to the box, bro. So I ain't even gonna talk about it. I'm just gonna open him up, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> man, it ain't Those came from T Boo, bro. Man, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hold on. What's focus? Focus on these things. There we go. Oh my goodness. Hey man, this ain't one of the most wearable shoes that was ever created. <laughs> Bro, um, I had somebody. I had somebody like every time I post them, but I uh, in any videos I had somebody uh, post it, and they was like, "Dude, take the zip tie off of them. Nobody wear their off whites with zip ties on them." I'm like, "What? Hey, you see, you see that little spaghetti I got on the side of them? Oh yeah. <laughs> hey, I wear these, bro. Like, <laughs> he hey, said, I, I wear gonna, these. Hey, I ain't even gonna lie." I went to a whole buffet. Hold on, let me see if it show. Look at that. I got all that buffet. I got the whole spaghetti line on on. on the, look at that, man. Dude, I, I, I lie. Lie. when you told I me when you told me that you had got these, I was like, bro, how, how? Straight from a hey, shout out to my twin, bro. Cause man, hey, listen. When that man said, hey, if you want them, just send me the retail on a live cop, bro. He sent me to got him and everything. He was like, hey, if you want them, they're yours. I'm like, hey, I, I sent over that money ASAP. <laughs> I don't even know. Hey, I don't even know if I had it. That was hey, that was back before um uh, after paying stuff like that. I after paid that nigga even before <laughs> even before it happened, bro. Like, hey, dude, yeah, these was uh and then the, the fact that it's a size 13 in women, because it was a women exclusive, that's even more rare. So I mean. Mm -hmm. But man, that's it, bro. Like, that's all the collabs I got. I mean, I got I got those two cactus jacks over there, but I don't feel like getting up getting them now. So <laughs> um oh yeah, those fire y'all last two, some of my favorites. Yeah, man. We appreciate you. Hey, hey, I appreciate you pulling up, staying with us, bro. But uh, like I said, man, make sure y'all subscribe to my guy King Kilo if y'all ain't already. Uh continue to check out the content. We're gonna continue to post up we actually are going to be starting the podcast also uh gonna be streaming on spotify all that good stuff and i also have um memberships that you guys will be able to enter it's 2.99 a month but for that membership you'll get exclusive access to videos and stuff like that but you're also going to begin um exclusive access to i'm downsizing my collection y'all i'm doing it so as i do this process for everybody that's been rocking with me, I want to make sure the people that, you know, subscribed and got the bell and stuff on, y'all get the first access to these sneakers. So as you guys sign up for the membership, you guys will be getting the first uh, perks on some of these shoes. And as you guys, as, as I go through my collection, what you guys are seeing is what I'm going to be selling. Uh, not sure everything yet, but a lot of it's going to be gone. He said, he said, I'm on it. <laughs> so um, again, I'm waiting for YouTube to approve the membership, the badges and stuff that I put out there. As soon as they approve it, you guys will probably get notified about a um, opportunity to, to be a part of the membership. And then it's going to be a Discord group in there as well. Um, so Family Vibes Discord, you guys will be able to see um, early releases and all that stuff. So I'm trying to streamline and trying to give you guys more information. So as, as this process goes, just work with me. Be patient. I'm going to streamline it. I'm not a tech guy, so I got people working on stuff. And as I get the stuff streamlined, you guys will get the information. But um, just make sure you got the notification bell turned on. But that's all I got for you guys tonight, man. Again, make sure you guys subscribe to King Kilo, my guy. Tap into his channel. Go follow him on TikTok. Yeah, man. Um, follow me on all platforms. King yeah, follow Kilo. All platform, King Kilo. King Kilo. I'm not, I'm not on, I'm on IG, uh, the tic tac and talk tic tac and whatever I don't do. So 
uh maybe i need to uh x formerly known as twitter i'm barely on that too but um i'm on here all the time so it is what it is but you got anything else man uh nah you pretty much hit everything on the on the head so hey just wait on the podcast Mm -hmm. coming soon so you guys can get more information and we're going to try to make sure you guys are plugged in so you guys are like the first to know or you guys have good knowledge on like what you're buying and the information to get the shoes like you know what i'm saying so yeah so as y'all watch the content also uh communicate with us man what do y'all want to see us do more You, you feel what i'm saying like we're trying to figure out the dynamics of everything, like wh- where where we want to go with our channels and stuff like that. So, hey, communicate. Hey, more mall vlogs, more on feet, um, more detailed reviews of certain brands or maybe, you know, broaden our scope a little bit. We open to ideas and stuff like that, but um, make sure you guys just let us know. But, man, yeah, we appreciate you guys pulling up. And uh, next week, what do I do next week? So I did Collapse. I did fours. I did threes. I can go to my 12 and 13s. I don't have any twos. Um, I don't have any. I got I got fives. I don't know. And, uh, t- t- hey, tell them you're on live. Um, oh. <laughs> but anyway, hey, I'll, fig- I'll figure out what I'm going to do for the, ne- <laughs> for the next live stream. Um, as far as the collection, but hey, I appreciate you guys, man. Y'all already know the sayings, man. Rock what you like, not what's hype. And hey, everything we talk about, just bait. Wait for me to share my faith. Hey, I'm gonna catch y'all next stream video. We out of here, man. Peace. Peace.